All right. Hi. Um, what I'm about to I'm about to do an unboxing and a short review of the I believe 2024 um, Spirit Halloween Low Lying Fog Machine. Um, I've been looking forward to getting one of these. Uh, dude, here it is. This is the, I believe, the thousand watt. Uh, I should have a light, so I should have checked that out just to make sure before. Um, right here. Open up the box. Um, to read before you begin, which is low. The fog machine needs time to warm up before it can produce fog. It may take three to five minutes. The fog machine will be ready to produce fog when the indicator, indicator light comes on. Fog machine will blast fog for approximately 30 to 45 seconds. Fog spray is optimized for dispersal every three minutes for proper effect and solution utilization. Always make sure there is enough fog liquid in the tank before using the fog, the fog machine. If the fog machine does not work, check the troubleshooting section in the instruction manual. If any parts are missing or broken, do not attempt to assemble the product or, you know, do repairs on it yourself. Um, that's the first thing. Then there is uh, the low. Oh, this is the 400 watt. It's kind of big. Uh, okay, this is or unless they didn't, they just put one in for everything. But it's like the frequently asked questions about the machine. Then there's the set of instructions. Um, I honestly I already opened this and had it out tested it out. But I'm just doing this for the unboxing so I see it as you you know when you get if you decide to get one and as it comes out, you know. Uh the parts list, instructions on putting it together and how to use it. You know, warnings, fuse replacement, and audit. Okay, so then there's the switch, I guess. I guess that's what this is called. Okay, it comes as you saw. Now, plastic like bag. Uh, this is the switch that fog switch says right there on it. Um, very basic. You plug it in the back, and it says right on it, light. Uh, when the light is on, the fog is ready, and you hit the button, and the fog comes out. Uh, if the light is off, that means the machine is warm. Uh, there's it's the this is the bracket handle that goes around the machine. It also it, and what I noticed, it also has three holes in it. Um, and I guess that's if you're going to mount it to hanging or suspend it above wherever. Um, yeah, so you can do that or carry it around. It's kind of big. I don't think anybody would do that. Uh, I guess for a transport or whatever. Then there's this. This is... Uh, it's a Western Park bag. Uh, most, okay. Plastic water bag. Uh, yeah. Most uh, videos I've seen about not just this or any other Spirit Halloween fog machine or any other type fog machine, they skip this. I'm not sure if it, if it comes with if any of them comes with them, any of the other brands include this. But uh, they never mention this. They never mention this. Uh, I believe this is for the 
the uh, when the fog machine sprays out the fog juice, as it's called, um, it the water mixes with it. You know, uh, the machine is designed to mix it to give it spray. That could be why it, uh, some they talk about uh, the spirit Halloween fog juice isn't as dense as they would like it. Uh, there's a few videos that say that. Okay, let's get to the actual fog machine. Like I said, I did take this out the box, test it out, try it. Um, yeah. And it, it's not even October yet. It's uh, end of September. But Spirit of Halloween is open, so, you know, oh crap, toy box. Because I had wanted to put this back in for storage, you know, um, but I'll probably get a tote or something. You know, it has these onions, um, so it's in bubble wrap. Uh, now, beyond that, who don't know, I'm 6'5", uh, 250, 260. Uh, this is a nice size. This is, I wear a size, what, 14 shoe? It's a little bigger than the, the, the shoe box my, my sneakers and footwear come in. Um, yeah, this, what really prompted me to do this review is this here, this opening for where the uh, fog comes out. It's different from the previous models I've seen and a lot of the other ones from other brands. Theirs are usually round, this is slotted. I guess this is part of the new 2024 design. It also has uh, on the top of it, a skeleton. Um, this here, section, unscrews, and, and there's a compartment for ice, ice that goes in there, uh, because it, it's an old fact, hot air rises, cold air sinks, so I guess to get it low line uh, across the ground, the ice goes in, it goes, this machine, it heats up. I don't think it's to keep it from overheating, but it heats up really quick and uh, goes through the ice. That's about maybe like a soup cup or cereal bowl size compartment. You know, uh, a soup cup uh, or cereal bowl of ice is barely what it fit in here. Uh, here is the two. Let me see what this is really called. Oh, it don't, it don't even say on the instructions or nothing. It just shows, uh, and I'll show a closer a picture of it. You take this here white tube, you fill this bed, the, the water bag, water, obviously, because it's got the water bag, and you put it in there. And you put this in here, like so. And, and it siphons out the water, to spray with the uh, fog juice as it, as it functions. On the back of the, uh, there's the, this is the plug-in for the, for the, uh, the switch. It's a real simple, basic, plugs right in. Uh, I am going to do a video about the different accessories, you know, uh, because this is a basic switch. Uh, they have one that has a timer on it and, and some other buttons. I don't know what for because I haven't, I don't have it, but I will go. But when I get one, I will go into it. Um, and they have hoses, different kind of hoses and stuff in, in that. Um, then there's the actual power switch, the, the cable, 
Then there's a level indicator for the uh, fluid compartment. Now I bought this bottle of uh, of the uh, Spirit Halloween fog juice. Uh, this is a quart. Uh, this practically fills this entire one bottle. Fills this entire uh, the, the reservoir of the machine. You should. You screw the head off, you screw, and, and where the skull's head is, kind of cool. And yeah, it's, you know, um, I have moved it around. There's still fog juice in it. That's why I've been careful. It, none of it has leaked out. You know, I have turned it upside down. I'm not going to because I do not want to intentionally uh, see if it is spilled or anything like that. Um, Really, really basic machine. There are some more elaborate ones. Um, yeah. So that's basically it. You know, um, I did, tr like I said, I did try, I did set it up, try it out. Um, indoor, which is not good unless you uh, take the batteries or disable your smoke detector. It will set them off. Um, but I noticed like in a lot of other videos where they're, where they're talking about uh, a fog chiller, where they take like some type of container, be it a garbage can, a tote, um, one use, one person used the ice, uh, ice cooler, a cooler for beverages and stuff you put ice in. And they put ice in the container. They run a, a usually a um because it's a DIY, a DIY project. Do it yourself. Um, you can't buy them. Uh, they had, people come up with all different designs because the concept of cold air is heavier. So and and to and that's what their attempt they they do is the fog that that's produced by this machine, goes into the container, usually through, like, uh, for example, um, the, the flexible duct tubing for uh, a dryer, or, or a garden or drain tubing. I've also seen that used uh, in two different ways, in the, in the container, and then they put ice in around it. Uh, I don't know if I'm gonna do all that. I might, I might later on, but because I've seen a few, because they have the round uh, port for the fog to come out, they they either connect the tubing to uh, uh, to the front of the device. And then put tape around it to create the seal. Uh, but because this is like a, a rectangular slot on here, uh, yeah. Uh, I've even seen like in the when I purchased it, the the spirit Halloween uh, accessory tube the holes for this, you know, so they can spray it out. Some of them. They get the drain pipe and then they drill holes every so many feet or inches so the fall comes out and you know uh the ones who don't attach the, the tubing i said they've gotten really extensive with these and they'll they'll buy like a little fan that they can like connect like the drain holes they'll take it put the fan on to to blow the smoke out, the fog out, and then they don't have to attach it directly, the the other end to the device, because as it's because it's on the hose line, a few inches or or maybe a foot away from the machine is causing suction to for the the fog as it's being dispensed by the machine to go right into the tubing because of the fan in it. 
and it blows it through the uh, container. Call it the chill container that's filled with ice. And then out the other side, you know, um, which caused a little. Now, what I also noticed is because when I first, when I first uh, uh, operated mine, it was indoors. It was in my basement where I'm at now. Uh, they, the, the fog still rose because it's heated. And this is a very small ice compartment. Uh, but a lot of it in, in the video that's included in it stayed along the floor. So, and then I also uh, tried the outdoor. And the, the uh, because of the wind, the the even the slightest breeze, the uh, the fog just blew everywhere. Any any whatever direction the wind is going. So so it's like the, having a controlled environment from indoor. Uh, it, it it's I think it's, a, it's a, I've been having a lot of fun with it so far. Um, and like I said, I, I'm going to look into the other devices. There are online, you can get all different brands of fog juice. There's different brands and wattage of, of uh, fog machines. Uh, yeah, so that's, that's pretty much it. And enjoy the demonstration. All right, so I got me a little fog machine. I've been waiting to do this for years. Yeah, check it out. Okay, see, that's it. Whoa. Low-laying fog machine. It's supposed to be cloud over the floor. Um, I couldn't wait to try it out. You know, I've been wanting one for years. Every every three minutes it cycles, disperses it. So yeah, this is pretty fucking cool. <laughs> oh, part of my language. Well, you can all, I can barely see the actual fog machine. Oh, this is like really cool.
Wow.